BYU heads to Kansas. And Kansas, an eight and a half point favorite with a total of 55 here. This is 2.30 p.m. Central Time on ESPN. Okay, let's look at it. I don't feel great about this, but uh, I've got BYU power rated as 3.62 points better. And the raw stats have got BYU favored by 4.92. BYU has played the tougher schedule. The stats show uh, that these two teams are playing actually pretty slow. Um, number 111 in plays per game. Number 112 uh, for Kansas. Like So two kind of slow teams. Uh, BYU, not great in offensive success rate by any stretch. They're number 127, but they have found ways to score, which is weird. Uh, they got outgained by like 140 yards against Arkansas last week and still won the game, still put up 38 points. I mean, just nuts. Um, the offense, number 72 PPA per pass, but number 124 in passing success rate, that ain't good. Uh, PPA per rush, BYU is number 107. Uh, they're number 131 in rushing success rate on offense. That ain't good either. And yet, they're number 37 in average field position. Uh, they are number 22 in points per scoring opportunity, uh, if they can ever get down there. It, just mind-blowing numbers thus far on this. Uh, BYU is number 13 in net explosiveness. Kansas is only number 80, which is weird for them thus far. I mean, Kansas went to Nevada last week and... Kind of put up a dud. They still got the W, but, man, they did not play well. I mean, it, they played significantly better against Illinois, but that second half of the Illinois game wasn't great either, right? So you you got Jalen Daniels back. Okay, let's see. Let's see what happens. I, I'll take BYU here. Uh, this is a scary position to take, uh, even though my numbers are, are saying to go that way. I know that Kansas can be explosive when they want to, and I believe in that offensive staff. They are masters at drawing these things up, but I am i can't go with them here. I, I think, I mean, Kansas has got Texas on deck next week. I'm going to take BYU to cover the 8.5, and, uh, and I can't figure out why the number is moving the opposite direction. Thanks for listening to Winning Cures Everything. Make sure and follow me on Twitter, at GaryWCE. If you want to toss in a question, you can email me, Gary, at winningcureseverything.com. Make sure and hit that subscribe button, and we'll see you next time.